I'd have to get three thousand. I d I don't think you're I don't think you're that far off, but for me, whoever buys this, they're gonna have to do a lot of work to the cases if they're gonna put it back into a bike. My clients are motorcycle people. In order for them to take this engine and put it back into a bike, they're gonna have to spend a lot of money. How about two thousand bucks? That's why I've got to get the price of this motor down to where I can make some money on it. How about twenty five hundred? You've got this manifold here as well. If you threw in this manifold, I'd do 22. If I can't get the price down, then I'm going to try to get something thrown in. This manifold isn't correct, but it has some value. 23 and you got a deal. 22.50. Make me, hey, I'm a, I'm a Packers fan. Run into that? All right, 2250. I don't know if I got the cheese head discount, but I did get one cool engine, and this turned out to be a great pick. Man, it's looking bad out here. I paid 2250 for the heat engine and manifold. I'm gonna ask 3500. Got those? I paid 200 dollars for five bundles of the aviation magazines. I don't know what they're worth, so I'm gonna have them appraised. I get my bombs. I also threw down 200 dollars for the Curtis Air Show posters. I'm gonna have Danielle pray those too. All right, thank you so much. Hey, great to meet you. It was you a guys. good time. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. It was. Time. It was an honor looking through this stuff. You guys are doing good things up here. I've got to give it to Danielle on this pick. We got first crack at a rare collection, and in our business, this is as good as gold. Take care. The most difficult item to let go today was that Henderson engine. See you, Jeff. But it was nice to see some of our stuff go out the door to what are going to be good homes, and it was just a good experience all around. <laughs>